What? You let them take two of our rings? I apologize. See, we... we figured if we stole a couple rings, you'd be proud of us. There's no point stealing theirs if we keep losing ours, you morons! I'm sorry, okay? But Lord Sombron will understand. We're his favorites, after all. He's not gonna scold us for losing a couple rings. Marnie. Yes? You should have done as I ordered. No more, and no less. I cannot protect you this time. Me? It's your fault we lost the Ring of the Holy Knight! I was following Lady Vale's orders. Do you mean to suggest she is at fault? Well, no, but... I will not make excuses. If punishment is due, give it to me. You? Marnie was merely seeking your praise. I am to blame. I should have stopped her. What a selfless display. To see you show care for a fellow hound. <sighs> I'm touched. Or perhaps you fear what I'll do to Lady Vale if I'm angry. <sighs> Alas, it's too late. I've already cast the spell. What? You promised to wait until our return. I meant to, I really did. But then the defect awoke. I had no choice. And don't speak to me of promises. You have broken your vow to Lord Sombron. As the head of this family, I must punish my children when they misbehave. Punish? What are you gonna do? Marnie, run! I don't think so. Look at that. Both out cold. Seemed painful, too. Stop your salivating. You have work to do, and I'm leaving. What should I do with them? Oh, they'll come crawling back. They have nowhere to be but at my side. I trust you won't be distracted from the task I gave you. Even as they inflict pain upon you, pay attention. There mustn't be the slightest doubt. I know. I've got to see if that loser is Lord Sombron's kid. Here we are. Elusia Castle. Sombron is likely within those walls. Vale, too. Yes. I hope she's safe. But there's a chance she'll face us as an enemy, not a friend. Be vigilant. At the first sign of danger, we should retreat. Oh. What's wrong? Those words. They're Marth's. That's what he told me at the Stenia Cathedral before... Before I lost him. We still haven't recovered from our defeat that day. What if it happens again? It won't. We're stronger than ever before. You've really stepped into your role of divinity. You really think so? Yes. That's why I know we'll get the emblems back. That's the highest praise you could give me. <sighs> Let's go. Is Elusia Castle usually this quiet? No. I would at least expect royal soldiers to be standing guard. Maybe Sombron dealt with them. You mean, turn them into the Corrupted? No. Who needs those boring soldiers when you can have me? Gris. Been a while, Divine One. Welcome. You must be tired after that long journey. Oh, and look, the long-lost princess. Got homesick, huh? <sighs> I gotta hand it to you. Two more rings in your pocket. Not bad. But for the complete set, you'll need more. Like... this one. The Ring of the Caring Princess! It's the real deal, too. I'll prove it. Celica! I'll give her back. All you gotta do is beat me. 
What is this? Nothing. What, you think Lord Sauron's gonna show up? It's one against many. We'll crush you. Mm, you know just what to say. Relax. No one's coming. If I'm wrong, I'll bite off my tongue and choke on my blood. What is this about? You want answers. You'll have to whack them out of me. Fine. I don't know what you're after, but we won't let this chance pass us by. Get ready, Gris. We'll make you give back that ring. Now you're talking. Make me, dragon. Tear me limb from limb from limb. Lady Lucina! Let's go! Let's keep the fun going. I'm gonna make you work for it. He vanished. Chris must be using Emblem Celica's power. He's probably hiding in the shadows. Be careful, everyone. I've got this. No mistakes. I will atone. My will is firm. Away. 
you looking down on me? <laughs> Serves you right. Yes. Emblem, engage! Here comes Amber! Whoa! Engage! Understood. May their souls find peace. Whatever you ask. I swear! Please die. Yes! So what's the plan? You're gonna stab me, mash me, shred me to ribbons? I will be a hero! <laughs> Gods, please protect us. Oh, Sally, you're all fired up, aren't you? Let loose! <laughs> this feels good. So good, I'm gonna kill you! All of you! Tired of playing hide and seek? Me too. Let's get vicious. As you wish. I'm sorry you're stuck with me. So no one can beat me. It was foretold. Been friends. I am sorry.
lady does it. was mine. Sorry. Nothing to fear. I really am worthless.
Get your loss. Let's go. Let's do this!
I'm exhausted. May all find salvation. There is nothing to fear.
if I may. I'm guided by the emblems. while you lasted.
I may. Unforgivable.
Like a hero. If this is war, so be it. Got it back. <laughs> what are you laughing at? Me? Nothing. Better summon her. Want to free her from Lord Sombron's power, don't you? I know. Care for us! Emblem of Echo! <sighs> Thank I thank you. Emblem Celica, it's such a relief to have you back again. <laughs> oh man, ain't this whole thing just a laugh riot? Zephia, that little hunch of yours was so dead on! I think it's clear you've lost your mind. Look at you, acting all high and mighty. It's clear you've lost your mind. Yeah, that's cute. The real question is, have you lost yours? You're playing up this whole thing like you're a god, but you're fighting on the wrong side. <sighs> Why are you staring at me with that stupid look on your face? You think you're a divine dragon? Let me set you straight. You are the child of the fell dragon! <laughs> Child? No, but... how? How dare you utter such slander, such lies! 
If the dragon doesn't remember it, how the hell would you know anything? Were you there a thousand years ago? Hmm? I'll tell you how I figured it out. Divine and Fell Dragons can both summon emblems, right? But they don't do it the same way. Divine Dragons pray. Fell Dragons, though... They use... invocations. <laughs> That's how you summon Selica. That's how you've done it all along, isn't it? Which means you're... Say it with me. The Fell Dragon's child. But then... I, I don't understand. Why did Mother call me her child? How should I know? You'll have to ask her. Oh, wait. You blackguard! <laughs> Sticks and stones, buddy. Anyway, now I've got what I came for. Too bad it cost me a ring, but I was told to buy time, and I did. Lord Sombron and Lady Vale should be long gone by now. You mean... they were here after all? Whoops. Didn't mean for that to slip out. Ah well, your Divine Dragon's a fraud. Take your time falling apart. Will you scatter to the winds? Cut each other's throats? So many options. See ya. Halt! I'm... I'm the Fell Dragons. He was lying, Divine One. I don't believe a word of it. We can't be divided by the enemy. We must be calm. Saying Sombron isn't here may have been another attempt to mislead us. Let's look around and make sure. Well? This place is well and truly deserted. Yes. Sombron is no longer in the castle. What should we do now? Uh, if what Gris said is true, I should leave. What do you mean, leave? The night Mother died, I had a nightmare where I was surrounded by flames. My hair and eyes were red. Now I see. It wasn't a nightmare. It was a memory. One bad dream doesn't prove anything. Maybe not. But this will. Emblem Sigurd. I am here. You knew me a thousand years ago, didn't you? Answer this. Was Gris telling the truth? Am I the Fell Dragon's child? You are. <sighs> How can this be? So it's true. I apologize. With your memories lost, we thought you could be happy living this way. That is what Lumera and I agreed upon the day you awoke. Why did Mother call me her child? Sombron had turned his back on you. Your life was in danger. Both you and Lumera wished, above all else, to be a family. That is the fullness of my knowledge. That's plenty, Sigurd. Thank you. I'm sorry, everyone. I'm not a divine dragon. I never was. You have nothing to apologize for. Only a divine dragon could imprison Sombron as Mother did. What chance do we have now of surviving this war? Without such power, there's no hope of stopping Sombron. Why would you assume you lack the power of a divine dragon? <laughs> you have fell dragon blood, yes. But you forget your own abilities. Think back to Flora Port, when my ring was returned and you summoned me. But I used an invocation. Emblems summoned through a fell dragon's power cannot communicate. Uh... Think back upon emblems summoned with the fell dragon's power. Could they speak? No. When I called out to them, they didn't answer. Please, explain further, Sir Sigurd. A fell dragon's invocation robs an emblem of their free will. Their service is compulsory. With a prayer, the emblem keeps their free will. A divine dragon would wish nothing less. You use both invocation and prayer. You mean... I do have the power of a divine dragon? Precisely. Your hair and eyes prove the fact eloquently. At one time, both were red. The blue is proof that through Lumera's love, you have inherited a divine dragon's power. 
Lumera shortened her life so that you could succeed her as the Divine Dragon. Mother. We emblems fight alongside you of our own volition. We could only deepen our bonds with you because you have the power of a Divine Dragon. You are the one intended to carry on Lumera's legacy. Will you still leave after hearing this? Is that your wish? No. I want to stay. I can't change that I'm the Fell Dragon's child. I know that, but... I would like to continue on as the Divine Dragon. If he will have me. Of course we will! <sighs> Alfred. Sure, first we came to you because we needed your help. But now I care about you. Fell or Divine or whatever else. We need you. So no more talk about leaving us. We'd never have made it this far without you. I will follow wherever you lead. If you have only half of your power, so be it. We'll make up for the other half. What matters to me isn't how you were born. It's what you do with the life you're given. If you choose to live as a divine dragon, then that's what you are. Conflicted as I might be, I am made resolute by the terror I feel at losing you. Because to me, you are the divine dragon. Your leaving would not change that bond. Everyone agrees. After all, you are what connects them. You are, and always shall be, the Divine Dragon. Thank you, everyone. There's much I don't know. I may have made choices in the past that I can't take back. But for now, I'll continue on this journey with you. We emblems will follow you, completely of our own free will. Divine Dragon. Mavir, it's you. I overheard your conversation about being Lord Sombron's child. If that is true, then I urge you to help Lady Vale. What? You're not here to stop us? All this time, Lady Vale has been sustained by a desire to meet her sibling. If she sees you, she will be saved. I know it. I'd like to support her like my friends here have supported me. Vale... The true Vale has been a friend to us, but we don't know where she is. She is traveling with Lord Sombron to the land of Lethos. Lethos? But why? You will have to trust me. I can explain on the way. What do you think? Let's go with him. <laughs> 